This is CNN Breaking News. Welcome, everybody. Breaking news from CNN. Uh, this news out of Syria. The United States is closing its embassy in Syria and is pulling out its um, remaining staff there. This new word coming in right now. Uh, you'll recall this comes after uh, a resolution that called for the resignation of the president of Syria, Bashir al Assad, uh, was rejected by a vote, veto by Russia and China. We've got Jill Doherty for us live in D.C. to talk about the impact of this announcement. Jill? Yes, right. Uh, CNN just confirming that the embassy has been closed. The staff have been pulled out. That's the American embassy in Damascus. The government, the Syrian government, we are told, the State Department saying, has refused to address its security concerns. And one of those major concerns was the possibility of some type of al-Qaeda action. They are pointing to a, a car bomb last month, which was apparently uh, carried out by al-Qaeda. So again, 17 members of the staff now out of uh, the Damascus embassy for the United States. And uh, this does not mean they're breaking diplomatic relations, but it's a serious step by the United States government. It's interesting that they're focusing it on security concerns and not focusing it on the resolution that was vetoed by China and Russia. But do you think maybe the two are linked? Uh, this has been an ongoing concern that predated that, uh, that vote. So I think you'd have to say that it's really a worry over precisely and, and any type of uh, threat by al-Qaeda. Jill Doherty in D.C. for us. Thanks, Jill. Appreciate that.